How's it going guys and gals and friends and pals, it's the Grim Hal here, and I'm bringing you a how-to video on how to animate an image in the Camtasia timeline. Now, if you know how to add an image, or if you don't, I can do a how-to video on that, but once you've added the image into the timeline where you want it in your video, what you're going to do to um, create the animation is you're going to go to visual properties now if it doesn't show up here it may show up in the more tab and you just click on it and then it'll show up now from the visual properties this allows you to change a lot of things the x-axis the y-axis uh, this is rotation obviously so you can rotate it you know one way or another so this is going to be how you create the animation first what you'll do is you'll go to add animation now, once you've added the animation, as you can see, you'll see this little half circle show up on the image in the timeline. So, what you're going to do, this is what I do because I find it a lot easier, is I actually just, like, if I wanted to go from right to left, I just, um, I just hit this, and it takes a little bit longer, but I think it's a little bit more accurate. That way you don't have to guess or anything like that. Although, it should fairly be the same, you'd think, but you never know so once you've done that that tells this that's the animation you want however to actually create the animation you're going to slide this across the image that way the animation actually takes effect so as you can see it decided it wanted to change position there for some reason and that's just the thing with Camtasia it's a great software it's pretty easy to use but there are some things that are complicated about it like for instance you can't record gameplay in full screen I mean there's technically a way I found a way to do it but that's because I have dual monitors and that's I guess cheating I don't know either way it lets it work but there are a few like you know drawbacks to it but I think that the editing software is very easy to use I have other editing softwares and maybe it's just because I don't use them as much but I find them to be really complicated and they don't do the things that I want them to do easily now the reason I'm posting this video is because my friend was saying you know I wish that I could animate animations you know into my videos um, but I don't know how and I don't know if Camtasia has the capability well it does have the capability and I've looked up videos like you know how to animate an image you know in Camtasia and it didn't really bring up as much as I was hoping so I decided to put this video out there for those of you who do use Camtasia and you know just I think it'd be pretty informative that way people don't have to guess and get frustrated or try to like copy and paste you know uh, an image you know over and over again in different positions because that would take forever so you can create the animation so this is what it'll look like when the animation is done. that it's as simple as that now if you want it to go by faster which you may want because you know you don't want it to take like a whole like what is this like 15 20 seconds five seconds which really isn't that long but if you want it to go by kind of like faster what you can do is is you can actually edit the clip speed of the image because the image doesn't have any audio associated with it so you can put it up to a thousand percent if you want to so that'll make the image go by like that very quick very fast and so that's pretty much it you know um I actually didn't know how to do this I sort of figured it out I had remembered something about it but I couldn't remember exactly so if this video does help you make sure to leave a like leave a comment down below if you want maybe a different how-to video you can check out some of the videos that I have on my channel they're mostly gameplay videos but you know you might like them, you might not. Hey, I ain't gonna force you or nothing. So, you know, leave a like, leave a comment. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and subscribe. And until next time.